Hey, what up? Top of the morning is Thursday. And uh, these celebrities need to uh, pipe it down a little bit about uh, making comments about people dying in certain sections, you know, over their jewelry and things like that. Cardi B made a statement and she said that she doubt very seriously if the posting of her location had anything to do with the murder of her boyfriend who was sitting right next to her. And uh, after she posted it, you know, they came up in there and uh, killed him. Nicki Minaj said, you know, after Pop Smoke, you know, our locations, you know, are very important. So nobody shared their locations because of, you know, you know, uh, advantageous jackers and robbers and scum of the earth. But she was she was on point when she made the comment and said that that's not a wise thing to do. So for Cardi B to come out and say that, you know, it's pretty much ignorant. Now, I'm asking Cardi B, you go to Roscoe's and you put your location and you say you an offset right there. But you're privileged to be like ultra rich, you know, uh, industry rich, meaning you got personal protection. See, he signed an independent deal with Atlantic Records like Nipsey Hussle. So it seems like, you know, they kind of let, you know, they promote the buffoonery and then they get the insurance money. And that's just keeping it real because it's kind of weird how that happened to Nip after he signed, you know, with a major. And then the same situation with his brother. And a lot of people didn't know too much about his music. So now his music is like going like super viral. Now this music is on a whole nother level now. And that's what they do because you're worth, you're worth more dead than alive. Look at Tupac and Jimmy Iovine and Jerry Heller and with Easy e and all of that. So, but, uh, but back to Cardi B, I'm sure if you give up your location, where you at, when they roll up there, it's going to look like a presidential motorcade in the parking lot, probably have traffic blocked because of your high end security. See, the black man is trying to build and we are, we are being influenced by our woman. So if the woman is influencing the black man, then the woman is, is a part of the demise of the culture. Because when you look at older rappers, Jay-Z got a verse, you know, on the song with DJ Khaled, man, God did, you know, Nas is on a whole nother level. You know, the, the, the rappers that, that survived, that made it, they're on a whole nother level now trying to be honest and be real and frank about what the mission is right now. See, back then we sacrificed the culture to get to where we are right now. But I guarantee you every rapper, you know, that's successful, that could go on tour, that's older, that was a part of the creation of rap, they're not talking that dumb stuff. The only ones that's doing it are the uh, B minus rappers and the one that really, you know, aided, ed, ed, uh, let me see, aided in a bed the demise, just like game. Game is supposed to, in my mind, supposed to be one of the top tier. But for whatever reason, he the top of the low lives because Drillmatic, why would you make an album called Drillmatic when they putting people in jail on RICO charges and using their rap lyrics to actually incarcerate them or indoctrinate them into crimes think about it but when you are part of that culture and when you put tattoos on your face and when you talk about old rappers back in the day now you're the old rapper looking stupid because you can't even switch code how can you switch code with all that on your face you can't and aramis was different aramis is 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 ethiopian he does not suffer from or did not suffer from post-traumatic slave syndrome like we do. So it's time to build. So the Megan Thee Stallions and the Cardi B's of the world, they're destroying it. I look at Megan Thee, B, Megan Thee Stallions lyrics. It was offensive. All she talking about, B, 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 ho, 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 B, 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 B's ain't, you know, just, just killing the culture. Cardi B, come on, man. You beef with Nicki Minaj, and the only reason you said that is to because Nicki Minaj said after Pop Smoke, no rapper in their right mind gives up their locations. Now, Pop Smoke inadvertently, but clearly these cats are smart. 
These cats are wise. These cats use social media and this is what they do. Now, but it'll take a person, an industry plant like Cardi B to say something like that to pretty much distract us. So let's stop looking at the distraction and focus on the powers and principalities that's allowing these things to happen. Come on, man. I'm speaking to somebody's spirit this morning. Because things got to change and they will change and they're going to change fast. So if you out of the loop, I'm telling you, you're going to look bad. So get on the right side of history. And I'm talking about socially, economically, politically, all of that. Help is on the way. It's already here. So when you start seeing these little grassroots pop up, just understand that the root is very deep. Hello, somebody. 